Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another weekly vlog. It is currently Thursday the 17th. I'm sitting in front of my calendar right now and I just finished the work day, logged off of my computer and Ryan and I are about to go do a run. Um, he's gotten me into running again. He is training for the half marathon in January and I decided I'm gonna run with him and he made me like a little workout calendar. I wanna show you guys what I'm doing, but basically I haven't run since last year. So I haven't run all year <laughs> and I was never a big runner to begin with. Um, but I'm gonna try and run um, some 5Ks with him. One is at the end of September and then the turkey trot on Thanksgiving and just run a few 5Ks and get back into it. I don't know that I'll ever be like a really big long distance runner, but I enjoyed it when it was really nice outside last year, like in the fall and winter, um, or not last year, actually it was two years ago. I really enjoyed running right around when COVID first started. I was loving it because it was a way to get outside and like, you know, still feel like a human when all that stuff was going on. So I really enjoyed it. Um, back then but i haven't done it in a few years so i decided to do it i'll show you guys my new kind of calendar that we built for me and i did actually curl my hair using the shark today um it's already like kind of gone but i think it turned out really pretty my hair is showing up very shiny on the camera okay it looks really good on the camera in person doesn't look that shiny but on the camera it looks great so that's good um and then i also used this new eyeshadow that i got in from Merit Beauty. Um, I did a video with them last year um, around like Christmas time. They sent me a little kit to try and gave me like a coupon code. Well, now I'm like on their PR list. And so they sent out this new cream shadow to try and then review on Sephora. So pretty cool stuff. Um, but it's already sold out on Sephora. Like it launched like two days ago and it's already sold out, but it was like this just matte brown. I think it's super simple and cute. It took 30 seconds to blend out. So I'll probably keep using that. And then I also used my new ColourPop shadow stick on the inside. It's so pretty on the inner corner. Um, and I'm very hyper right now because I just had a energy drink. <laughs> I just had Nalani new before we go um, do our workout. But yeah, let me show you the calendar that we built. And then um, I'm gonna go change into my workout clothes and we're gonna get that done. And then this weekend, we don't have a ton of plans. Um, Ryan's parents are coming in on Saturday cause it's his dad's birthday today. And we're gonna celebrate with lunch and that's all the plans that we really have. I did order some furniture things for the apartment just to like finish decorating. Um, I need to get some wall decor for the office but like that's the last step. Um, so we'll probably be cleaning a little bit and putting that together in the living room later this weekend, but that's like the big plans. So let me show you my new workout calendar. So I keep my calendars like right next to the pool. I like this one because it like blocks people from viewing me um, and also makes sure that I have like a little blinder on so I don't look at the pool all day. But anyways, this is my little calendar. As you can see, we started on the 14th and this is totally just customized for me for getting back into running. So nothing like crazy. Um, and I color coded it. You guys know I'm very type A. I love to check a box. So I've checked the boxes on the ones that I've been doing. Still doing Pilates two times a week because that's like my active recovery. It allows me to stretch a lot. I love going to it. So still doing those. And then two days where I use weights and um, lift weights. So upper body and this one's lower body, which is today. And then doing a one mile easy run and including the bike in there at some point in the week because I do still like to do the Peloton rides, so those are fun. Um, this one, aerobic one mile, means you keep your heart rate within a certain range. So I'll probably have to stop a lot because my heart rate was at like 180 on my easy run on Tuesday, which is pretty bad. So I just need to you know, get myself back into a running mode and then my heart rate will go back down. Um, and then Saturday and Sunday are based off of what Ryan's doing too. He's doing um, sprints, so I will be doing sprints with him. And then um, two mile tempo run is basically, I need to do a two mile run at whatever pace I want to be at for a race. So it'll probably be like 10 to 12 minute miles just because I haven't run in so long, but that's my little workout schedule. 
but I'm very lucky that Ryan just made that for me. He knows a lot more about running and working out than I do. So yeah. Um, but yeah, that's the update for now. I ordered a ton of stuff on Etsy last uh, over the last week. Um, I just had so many things that I had saved in my cart for fall and some things for Kai. So I just went ahead and bit the bullet and bought the stuff. So I have some little custom bandanas coming in for Kai. I bought a few like fall um, coffee tumblers and some slippers. So I have some fun things coming in the mail and I'm really excited about them. So hopefully some of them will come in and I can show you while we're on this vlog, but you should see those sometime soon too. So fun things are coming to the vlog and yeah, I'm gonna go and change into my gym clothes and I will see you guys later. Hello guys, it is now Friday mid-morning, it's like 10. I decided to take a little break from work because my Wi-Fi is not working and come over here and do my makeup and Kai has decided to join us. But I did my makeup in front of the mirror today, which I never do, like sitting down. And again, I used the little Merit um, shadow. And then I think today I'm gonna use this ColourPop Shadow Sticks in Friday Feels. It's like coral, so let's see how this goes. I'm gonna try and record while I put it on and we'll see how that goes, but. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Uh, are you seeing this? Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Hmm, I don't know how I feel about it, just like on the inner corner. I think I'm just gonna put it all over my lid. Okay, it's like fun, I guess. Yeah, I think it's cute. I wish I did have this brown shade in a little bit darker. Um, cause it's kind of like, just like a really light brown. You can see like, this is the color of it. So I wish I had it a little bit deeper so I could like deepen my outer corner, but I think it looks really pretty. So this is the look for today. I'm going to go back to work. Hopefully my Wi-Fi is working. If not, I'm going to have to like restart my router, but yeah. Anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Hello guys. It is currently Saturday. It is about 1130 ish. Ryan's pants are coming over and we're gonna have, we're gonna go out to lunch. So that's gonna be fun and I'll show you guys the outfit. So I opened up the blinds for you guys, but it's so hot. We've been keeping the blinds closed. But anyways, the outfit is, I put my hair in a ponytail because we ran this morning and it's all sweaty and gross. So ponytail plus a little scrunchie, just a plain blue tank top, my little Shein white skirt and some heels just to dress it up a bit. And then my new bag. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and take the dogs out one last time before we leave and I will talk to you guys later. <laughs> We're watching Kai's sister Ray. For the week and there's Kai on the couch. <laughs> she's so cute. Oh, she's a sweetie pie. Yeah, she's a little cuddle bug. She likes to be. Oh, she just sat smack down on me. <laughs> she's so cute. I'm making my grocery list, so. <laughs> self-care Sunday. <laughs> As you saw this morning, I did a little run, more like a walk, but I did a two mile run. Very proud of myself. And then I'm about to open up this new skincare fridge because my pink one is not working anymore. It turns on, but it doesn't get cold anymore. So I bought a new one. So I'm going to set that up with you guys. I'm wearing my little eye patches. I just did an everything shower, washed my hair. And yeah, it's definitely going to be a self-care Sunday. I'm currently soaking <laughs> my shoes to uh, clean them. So wish me luck. Um, I found this like cleaning product for shoes on TikTok shop. And so I'm trying it out. So I'll let you guys know how it goes, but basically all the shoes that I did, I was about to throw away anyways. So I'm hoping that I don't have to throw them away. So I'll update you guys on that, but I'm gonna unbox the skincare fridge and then I'll show you what I put inside of that. 
So I just got the white Frigidaire mini fridge. It fits like six cans of Coke or something. And this is the pink one that I have. Hey, but it does not work anymore. It turns on, but it's not cold. Okay, just because I'm extra and my eye patches are slipping. Just because I'm extra, I did film a TikTok stocking my mini fridge with skincare. So let me turn around and show you. And I think it actually is bigger than my old one. So that's cool. So I got her all set up. I will not leave that candle there, but I just had it for filming purposes. But I am burning blueberry cheesecake from Homeworks, testing it out in a smaller room because I had it in my living room area yesterday and I really couldn't smell it. So I'm just gonna test it out in my bedroom today and I'll let you guys know what I think. But anyways, inside of here, first off, it is very, very quiet if you can hear it. You could probably hear Incredibles playing in the living room more than you can hear this. So that's really good. Um, but I do have, this is my everyday setup, is this Ordinary Caffeine Solution for my under eyes and Mary Kay Vitamin C Solution. So those two I use every single morning. And then every single night I use the Mary Kay Timers Repair Eye Cream. So that's like my everyday routine plus the Gua Sha, which I just got this from Marshalls. It's the Beauty Fridge brand, but any brand will do. And then I do like to put some eye patches in here. I have these new Tony Moly Plumpkin Retinol eye patches. I've not used these before, but I am about to run out of my C'est La Vie ones that I got at Marshalls. Or maybe I got these at Ross. Um, but since I'm almost out of these, I'm going to replace them with the Plumpkin ones. Let's see if this will still fit in here, though. Okay. And then I have this... Rodile Dragon's Blood Hyaluronic Mask. I got this in a FabFitFun. I haven't had FabFitFun for like three or four years, so it's pretty old. So I'm gonna try and finish it, but it's basically an overnight hydrating mask. So I like to do that like once a week. So that's the top shelf and like every day. And then down here, I have some stuff that I don't use as much. This is the Creme Shop, like a, oh, it's an Aqua Cure Intense Hydration Multi Balm. It's a hydrating balm stick. I got this in the winter when my skin was super dry. I don't really need it right now, but it's good for the winter time and it's very cooling. And then this Glossier Future Dew Oil Serum Hybrid. I also use this more in the winter time. I haven't really used it in the last couple of months. And then I have this Crave Beauty Great Barrier Relief Serum. I actually got this for Ryan, so that is in there just for him. But that's my little skincare, so not a ton of stuff. But I think this one is deeper because I can fit kind of like double what I could fit in the last one. So I think that's definitely a win, but that's my little fridge all done for you guys. And then I actually went and put a little towel underneath it because I will say if you're gonna have a skincare fridge, if you're putting it on wood, put a towel underneath because mine would always leak like no matter what. So just put a towel under there just in case you never know, so. So now that my little skincare fridge is done and I recorded some more content, we're gonna go schedule out and plan our content for the week because I've been slacking so hard on Instagram lately. So we're gonna go plan out content and edit a little bit and then I will probably just blow dry my hair. Good morning, guys. It is currently Monday morning. I'm getting ready for work, but I figured I would come on here because this vlog is definitely going to go up late. <laughs> Our Wi-Fi has lost power. Like, <laughs> this is the weirdest thing ever. But we noticed the Wi-Fi was like cutting in and out recently. And we were like, oh my gosh, there must be a problem with AT&T. Maybe because it's so hot outside. Well, actually, it is the closet. And I'm sorry if you can hear the lawn, the leaf blowers and lawn mowers and stuff outside. You can like hear it through the vent in the bathroom. But anyways, um, it's actually the closet where the um, Wi-Fi router lives. Like that's the only spot where it's able to plug into. Um, the closet is losing power. So I don't know how that is possible, but our building, like certain areas of the building have been losing power lately. I think because it's so hot, they don't actually give us a reason, but they're like the elevators and some of the hallways end up without power. And it's been happening on and off <clears throat> for about a week. But finally, our closet lost power um, like the middle of the day yesterday, and it hasn't gotten power back since. So I don't have Wi-Fi to work from home today, and I can't leave the dogs um, by themselves. <clears throat> 
So we put in a work order, I believe yesterday, um, for the apartment complex. So I'm hoping that they come today. I put it as a high priority. They usually are pretty quick about work orders, um, but I don't know how they're gonna fix that. Like, I don't know how you fix that, but I need power to that closet to work so that I can have Wi-Fi to work from home. And I can't leave the dogs all day. I, well, I especially can't leave them while I'm waiting for somebody to come for the work order because I don't want to leave them out, you know, and somebody comes in for the work order. <laughs> so I have to basically just sit here and wait. So I'm gonna text work, I guess, that I don't have Wi-Fi for the time being. But yeah, that's fun. So anyways, <laughs> this vlog is gonna go up late <laughs> because I don't have Wi-Fi to edit it and upload it, or to upload it actually. But you do need Wi-Fi for airdropping, which I usually just airdrop my videos to my Mac to edit on my Mac. Um, but you can't airdrop without Wi-Fi. And I tried doing my hotspot last night, but it doesn't work like that either. So I apologize, but this vlog is gonna be going up late. So, yeah, I hope it gets fixed today though. And I'll keep you guys updated, I guess. But I'm just gonna finish doing my makeup and we shall see how the rest of the day goes. Okay, you guys, it's much later in the day and we just got back from a walk and Kai's new running booties came in. I'll give you guys a little sneak peek of them. And then this adorable cup came in the mail. Oh, I got this off of Etsy. I'll try and link the shop down below, but like, oh, it's a double walled insulated tumbler. So it's not just like the regular cups that they have, but I think it is smaller. Like, I think it's not as big. I think it's only like 16 ounces, but I did actually get a cold foam lid for it. So that's gonna be fun to use. So I got like a little cold foam lid. Yes, okay, it does fit sweet. So now I can do cold foam on top of my ice drinks and drink it like I'm drinking an actual Starbucks drink. It has like a little sippy. Ah, you're getting me, so cute. And then here's Kai and his sister Ray. But I put the boots on. We're gonna leave them on for a little bit just so he can kind of get used to them, only on his front feet. But they're called wag wear and they're basically like Crocs for dogs because it is, you know, 100 plus when we're walking around. We don't really go on walks with him a lot while the sun is out, usually. If anything, I'll try to like go a, a lap around the block at like 7 a.m. with him or at like 8 p.m. or 9 p.m. once the sun is already down. Um, but it's just too hot to go on our usual walks with him, which would be around like six o'clock after work and stuff, which is what we used to do. So poor baby's put on a little bit of weight because it's just too dang hot. But I'm hoping with these booties on, he can last a little longer and he can start to go on runs with us too while both Ryan and I are training. So wish us luck. He's probably gonna hate them, but he, he will learn to love them. And I already gave him quite a few treats just to try him on. So, yeah, he's gonna take a nap in them. Sweet baby, look at that face. I put bandanas on them today just because they were looking extra cute. I don't want them to be naked. It's so cute. And another update while I'm on the floor here petting the dogs, um, they did come and fix the router, so Wi-Fi is working. They came at like 9.30, 9.45, and it was actually like a wire that was loose in one of the light switches in the bathroom, which is where the router lives in that closet. So it was just like short circuiting and not allowing power to get to that room. So they fixed it, we're all good. We do have Wi-Fi, so everything is fixed. So I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here and edit it. It'll be up on Tuesday, hopefully, and I will talk to you guys later. So see you all later. Bye. Everybody say bye-bye. Bye-bye.